Every day, Nettie's teacher is a reading and writing role model for the children. She knows that young children become interested in reading and writing when they see it's useful for her. The teacher tries to make sure that there's lots to read and write at school. Story time! Once upon a time, there was a brave boy. He lived far away in a land where there was a dangerous dragon that guarded the beautiful palace on top of a high mountain in a dry desert. In that castle lived a beautiful and wise princess. Nellie's teacher tells stories and reads to the children every day. Nellie's teacher also knows that everybody has stories to tell and she wants to hear them. Who would like to tell us a story today? Everyone did. My granny told me a story last night, said Nellie. You tell your story and I will write it down. Then we can read it again later. Once upon a time, there was a girl called Nellie, said Nellie. She wanted to give her father a present, but she had no money. She thought of all the things that he would like. A car, a new hat, a sweet. But she was so sad because she had no money and she couldn't give him anything. That was a lovely story, said Nellie's teacher. You're all learning to write so that you can also write stories. I want to write my story myself now, said Nellie. I also want to make a book, said Sipo. Me too. Can I tell you my story, teacher? asked Pussy. We can all make books today, said the teacher. Nellie's teacher lets the children explore print every day. She encourages them to write using their own spelling. This means she allows them to be adventurous and use what they already know about writing and spelling to write things they want to say even if they can't write and spell correctly yet. Their mistakes help her to see what they understand and what they still need to learn. She's interested in what they are writing about, gives help when it's needed, and trusts in their ability to learn. She also shares some different reasons for reading and writing with them. Nelly, your granny knows so many stories. Would you like her to come to school to tell one? asked teacher. Yes, yes, yes! said Nellie. Okay then, let's write her a note and invite her to come. Hmm, now what shall I say? Dear, dear Granny, said Nellie. Dear Nellie's Granny, please would you come to our school tomorrow and tell us a story in class? Thank you, from Nellie's teacher. I'll give it to her when I get home, said Nellie, very pleased.